Across the European continent, at some of the most glamorous summer destinations, tourists often outnumber the locals in these hot summer months. And this year, numbers are sky high. 55% more American tourists in Europe than last year. Officials in Rome say they could reach a record flow of 30 million visitors this year. There are a lot of tourists, this local resident says. Some extra buses wouldn't hurt. Many Americans descend on Italy's famed Amalfi Coast to the picture-perfect town of Portofino. But beware, don't linger long, or you could be fined more than $300 here for snapping a selfie. In Athens, tourists swarm the Acropolis, where visits in June and early July are already up by 80 percent compared to the pre-pandemic summer of 2019. And here in the UK, just outside of London, Americans are flocking to Richmond-upon-Thames. You may recognize it from the mega Apple TV hit, Ted Lasso. How you feeling? A little nervous. Well, heck yeah, no such thing as last day, James. Whoa. Here's what we all came for, the one, the only, Ted's front oh door. Oh my God. God. That's so cool. And now the so-called Ted heads are taking tours of the show's stomping grounds. Super fans, yes? Like yeah. a truly mega know everything. Absolutely. Like, we watched the, we watched the season three times as a family, and we all live in different places. She's in New York, mm -hmm. he's in LA, and we're in the San Francisco Bay Area. Okay, my hometown. And we love oh it. My God. People are literally booking their tickets to come do this. Exactly. They are coming to London, but specifically to Richmond. And when they tell, you know, just a random British person they meet off the street, they're like, oh, I'm going to Richmond. They're like, what? Why? And they're like, Ted Lasso, of course. So far, residents here seem to be enjoying the spectacle. One, two, three, Richmond! Richmond! Or at least not complaining in that very British way. In scenic Switzerland, this small town of Isotwald, population about 400, is also overrun with tourists, fans of the Korean Netflix series Crash Landing on You. And for a cool $5, you too can take a snap on the pontoon. In the fairy tale town of Halstead, Austria, the inspiration behind Frozen's idyllic Arendelle, cold, 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 cold. locals put up a temporary fence to stop the selfie taking masses. The fence now gone, but residents are still begging tourists to let it go. Now, one thing to know, you guys, prices really are higher from flights to hotels, even to the cost of food, basically across Europe. But here in London, at least with the weather, Ted Lasso fans know what they're getting into. And I got to say, you guys, even on this rainy, rainy day, we've still seen a bunch of people coming by taking pictures of that famed pub. I'll send it back to you. Molly, looks fun. Uh -huh. Thank you. Oh, and the weather there looks like the weather here. <laughs> yeah. It's missed. Friday afternoon there, so you should go get a pub. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I love it. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.